We have five original buildings on the property and we are uh, rehabbing and repurposing all of them. Two of them are historic buildings and so we're, we're saving those buildings and rehabbing them to their historic standard. Um, and we're going to have a variety of tenants in here. Um, we'll have a brewery tenant, a creamery, taco, pizza, small event space, and uh, some concept that is yet to be determined in, in the Ice House building here. There's a, a large central courtyard that um, is in the middle of the, the beer and the ice cream and the pizza and the tacos, and it has a bunch of outdoor seating, uh, covered areas that we want people to come and hang out and be outdoors, indoors, um, very casual and family friendly and uh, local. This is something where we want to um, highlight local businesses, local operators, restaurateurs. Uh, our creamery is one thing that I'm most excited about about this project. And we partnered with a, a local family dairy farm out of uh, Cushing, and they will bring in their raw unprocessed milk and process it on site daily and turn it into ice cream, soft cheeses, bottled milks, things like that. And you'll be able to go in there and get your ice cream and coffee and baked goods and, and see the process uh, of all of it being made. The historic buildings were the catalyst for the project. The courtyard has become the heart of the project. And so we, we see that as being really the gathering place. In the courtyard itself, instead of having traditional ornamental landscaping that, that look, just looks beautiful, we will have uh, landscaping that, that we call edible landscaping done in the same way where it's beautiful, but it's also productive. Um, so for example, instead of having uh, a, a tree that, that's just there to look nice, we'll have lemon trees, which are native to Oklahoma. They grow well in this climate and they produce lemons. Um, instead of uh, any screenings that we have with, with ivy or vines, we'll use blackberry because they, they, they are vines and, and they grow the same way and they provide the same screening, but they also produce, they produce blackberries food. So we'll do that within the courtyard. Um, out in front of the, the ice house building here, we're going to have a greenhouse, um, but it will be productive, it will be profitable, and uh, what we hope it will be is educational. I have been working on this for a little over two years, uh, a long time. Uh, fortunately, we're seeing the light at the end of the tunnel here, and, and we think we're going to get it done and open late summer or early fall of this year. That's the goal.